And yeah, that's so, the other thing, ChatGPT, like the, the recent like obsession with AI, like yeah. ChatGPT and regenerative AI and stuff. Like that was another thing because it's like, like for me, I'm like, why are we doing this? Yeah, I don't see a point in it, but you know, that's my perspective. But people are excited about it because most people's interaction with robotics is like sci-fi. Well, I mean, people and, definitely know, have... conflate AI and robotics a lot. Like that's kind of I'm sure you deal with this too. Especially, yeah, you know, very much, yeah. Um, where people just think we're, we're highly and I are um, the same thing. I mean, they're very real. I mean, especially like in CMU, that they, it was it was taught side by side. Yeah, well, and, and and they like are. Very, yeah, I guess you're right. And I mean, and they are pretty interrelated. And well, it also depends on what you define as AI. And it also depends how you're using AI. I mean, because like, I don't know, like Chat GPT is not a robot, but like, you know, I don't but know. Robots use a star. And A stars, and yeah. Artificial intelligence. Wait, A algorithm. stars? Would you consider A star artificial? Okay. Yeah, I mean, it's that's making a decision. Yeah, no, right? that's true. Would you consider like an auto tuning PID control to be artificial intelligence? Mm, maybe. I mean, it's it's not really well defined, right? Like these these are all kind of marketing terms. What about Dijkstra's like, algorithm? Is that considered to be artificial intelligence? Um. I'm going to say yes, just because it was taught in my artificial intelligence course. Interesting. Okay. Uh, but it's making me question that as well. I just, I just don't I mean, know, right? Like, yeah. I, I, I guess you're right. That's like a definition issue is like what really is AI and like, 